Hello, me again. So I like to have stuff on my YouTube channel for myself <laughs> when I want to go ahead and um, gain inspiration. This is an A5 astrology that I used to use in 2019 for a lot of faith-based stuff. I want to say somewhere in my videos I called it a Jesus book. But we're going to flip through the whole thing because why not? And this paper is wonderful on this Pilot Multi-Barrel Pen. I wish I could find one, but I can't. And it's it's kind of like thin, fine, thin nib, but it is dark. And I really, really like the way it wrote in this um in here so you're gonna see a lot of like scripture study um podcast notes devotion notes like little pages i want to say my counselor gave me these negative cognitions and positive cognitions um but i turned them into more of faith-based um 2018 19 half of 20 was a lot of heavy counseling for me i still believe in that everybody needs a counselor I at one point was going to become a counselor. I'm like six classes away from it, but I just decided more like coaching is my style because with counseling, I love what they do. They get to, it's talk therapy. And I have too much ADD for talk therapy because I'll be like, girl, what is your problem? You need to let this go. <laughs> And as a counselor, you can't do that. You got to just listen to them, um, you know, and help them through the journey and come alongside them. And I love that aspect, but I'm, I, I, there's only so much, like, listening I can do before I'm like, sis, we're going to pray about this. We're going to let this go. I mean, like, we're going to move on. We can't, we can't dwell. Like, I don't know. Um, I know that I let myself have pity parties for, like, a good maybe couple hours. And then after that, I'm like... Uh, you can't do this no more. So although I love counseling and I will always be into it, but there, it takes a certain breed. Um, so who knows what I'll do when I'm a little older and get a little bit more uh, patient. <laughs> so like journaling, um, picture journaling. I did that a lot. Let's see. Probably talking about my marriage, prayers. Ooh, this is that one pin from, and, and, you know, guys, it's raised off the page so you could feel it. It's, it's wonderful. Um, it's like that Pentel glitter pins that are like super bold. I love writing in different colors. I think these are like those Muji pins. Washi. At some point, this turned into a mock Hobonichi Cousin A5 because I know I wanted to have that, and I very I did buy one in 2019. I should have went upstairs to get my cousin so we could flip through that one too, and I can have it all in one video, but my behind didn't. So, living truth, ponder, grace yourself, do this. I like that. Dear friends, God is good, so I beg you to offer your bodies to him as a living sacrifice. Think pure thoughts, spiritual worship, renew your mind. Um, I, I, I very much like lists. I like things that tell me what to do, which is why I love soap study so much. Um, but it ain't easy. Once once you are in the word, you have an obligation to fo to follow it. And you will get test after test. Test and trials will be your whole life until we go to till we go to to to, to um, heaven. Like they help us grow. And sometimes I'm like, Lord, but I didn't. But I don't want to grow today. I didn't. I didn't ask for to grow today. Sometimes I'm like, I stop playing, praying for like patience because I'm like, mm -mm, God, you gonna make me do something. <laughs> That's my way of thinking sometimes, and it ain't, that ain't the Lord. He don't, he don't work like that. Okay, so I think this is where I started doing, like, daily pages, and then I wanted a weekly. Boom. I find so much fulfillment in this freaking page. 
because it's just different stickers of different colors of different things everywhere and it's a mock of the cousin and then I know some people are like what is this I'm like let me tell you it's like sticker prettiness like this on a page and I love it I love this I need to get back to this this is what my commonplace books are. You can call it what you want. Commonplace, like, I don't know. Like, I, it's blank paper filled with life. Ooh, fasting 18 hours. I know you were doing something in 2019. This is the year where I maintained pilot multi, multi ball jet pins. That's where I got it from. That's what this pin is. Yes and yes. Um, 2018, I was at like my heaviest. In 2019, 20, I maintained my weight. In 2021, ooh, went through it, went through it. And then I think this is when I went back to faith. Yeah, so I had a little spat with the cousin stuff because I bought a cousin. So all these pages. And then I went into uh, kind of more of the faith again, soap study. While I was doing it, it every day and which is why soap study is so um pivotal for me it's just a short way to study um a book i mean a, a verse and it just helps me to okay what what is this saying but what what can you do and you know like my prayers are most times like confessions of it um i'm very very genuine about my faith walk if y'all grew up in southern california and you remember victory outreach church that's why i got saved that's why i kind of have that come as you are attitude because that's what they live by it's like you can come off the street and i don't care if you just had crack this morning like jesus still loves you and i, I watched them as a young kid do that for older people and it just it just helped how to put God first in your life. Let go of what others think. Admit you are a sinner and need God. Repent, turn from sin. Believe Jesus died and rose again for you. Oh, Jesus, yes. So I just love, I want to go back into my really cool washi. I love writing, y'all. But in this book, I did tear out um, the pages I didn't use. And I now use those in my rings I want to say I have them right here and I use that paper for my ring planner because I have um, a bullet journal section in my rings and I use that for you know a bullet journal so interpreting the Bible mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Christ what blocks you Christ lives in me. What blocks you? Lacking understanding sometimes. I want things my way. I can be critical with controlling ways. Affection and closeness seems hard for me. I have too much to say. Not shutting up. Thinking my input needs to be. <laughs> Sounds about right. My gifts are evangelism, discernment, and exhortation. Those are my gifts. Messenger of the good news, distinguish truth from error. So a lot of people, and I know in my life, like even like my family members, they they confuse this gift with me being judgmental and me being like mean or rude. Some people call me bully just because, you know, I speak the truth and they ain't trying to hear it and I irritate their demons. So I'm very confident in these gifts. Trust me, I've, 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 I'm very confident. Um, exhortation, come alongside someone with words of encouragement. I can, yeah. I'm so thankful God gives us gifts. You know what I mean? And I think this is the last. 12 things in Colossians. Yes. Still have a few pages, honestly, in here. I should take this pen off because uh, I've been leaving it there and I'm not even using it. So looks like I cut this down to fit like a cover. That's why it's thinner or shorter on the sides and the bottom. 
But y'all, I should just add this to the stack of books I've um, completed, but I really love flipping through it. So I might be making another one pretty soon. I might do like a half year A5 Stology. Yes. Thanks for watching.